In this tutorial I'm going to show you how you can use a VLOOKUP table. I've got a spreadsheet here with some test scores and what I want to do is um, return the grade that the student has got based on their test score. Now it works really easily. I've got the table of information here, so 0 is a U, 30 is an E, 40 a D, up to 70 which is an A. I need to put up uh, a VLOOKUP formula in this cell here that I've selected now um, which will look up this score and then return the grade. So it works like this, equals VLOOKUP, open your brackets. You, the first thing it says is what value do you want to look up? Well it's the score I want to look up. So I click on the score, there it is. Um, I then put a comma in. It then says what's your table array? Well in this case my table array is here, so I select my table array. Because I'm going to be dragging down in a minute, I want to make this an absolute cell reference, so I need to press F4 on my keyboard, um, and it puts dollar signs in, every, in front of everything. Pay attention to this bit, because I haven't selected the, the text, the score and the grade, I've just selected the table of information. Those headers are just there to make it easier for me to understand what the table is. So once I've selected my table array, I press comma. It then says column index number. Well. Column 1 is the test scores. I want to return column 2 because that has the grades. So I'm going to type in 2 and press comma. It then says uh, true, which is an approximate match, or false, which is an exact match. In this case, it's true because the scores may not necessarily be 30 bang on or 40 or 50 bang on. It could be 35 or 55 or something like that. So it's an approximate match. So I'm going to click on true and I'm going to close my brackets. Now this student should get an A because they scored 100%. If I drag it down, it should say an A again. If I drag it down, this time it should say a U because they didn't score 30. They got 20. If I drag it all the way down, I should get all my grades. And I can just make this look a little bit neater by centering them to make it easier for you to see. And that is how you do a VLOOKUP.